Welcome back to another vlog. Today we have a massive transformation that we've done on a Range Rover Sport. It's an older model, but a customer from Leeds came to us and he said, I want to transform my Range Rover Sport so it looks better than my brother's Range Rover Sport. His brother had a Range Rover Sport Luma, which is beautiful, good body kit, of course. Respect to Luma and all car designers out there, because I know it's very hard to design body kit. Don't get me wrong, Luma has a brilliant body kit for the Range Rover Sport. So the only kit that we have for the sport is the Badenzai Wide Edition Cabaro. That's the kit that went on his car because that looks like a beast. It's almost complete, transformed right behind us. But just before we go to the car and uh, show you what we've done on the car, we're just going down the workshop and show you what we're doing. We've got Luke who's uh, scrubbing the roof. Now, what are you doing there, Luke? Cleaning glue. Looks like you, hey? Cleaning glue. Cleaning glue for spoiler. Somebody's poor job. The car's coming here. It's a Ford pickup. And we've put this wide body kit on it, but it had a roof spoiler on there, which was uh, not fitted correctly. And uh, the customer's bought, obviously, another spoiler. He said, remove that for us while you're putting all these wide pods and arches on. And uh, as you can see, that's been ripped off. Looks like proper butcher that off there where the LED lights aren't working and uh, I think Luke, Luke needs another haircut as well. I was sure you remember last time when we cut his hair, one of the vlogs. Right Luke, what do you think? Do you think I did a good job? Be honest. Yeah. Looking back at it now, it's been about a year, hasn't it? Yeah, it cost you It wasn't that bad, was it? No, it wasn't that bad. Is it one of your best haircuts you've ever had? <laughs> that, was he trying to say no there? Right, anyway. I'm sure it was. What do you guys think? I mean, you've seen the video of it now. I think I did a brilliant job. But uh, yeah, so uh, we are doing all the pickups now. So if you do have a pickup Ford Ranger, we do the wide edition body kit, spoilers, etc. We also do a body kit for the Mercedes uh, pickups as well. So we will be getting into them very, very soon. So uh, stay tuned for the pickup body kits coming and also the off-road wheels as well. And uh, yeah, we've got the uh, another Cabaro, very popular Range Rover Sport Cabaro. We've changed the bumper now. So the rear bumper uh, of the Cabaro body kit for the Range Rover Sport has slightly changed. We are making uh, an addition, so there'll be two additions, which one is the older uh, model, but where we are superseding it with bigger exhaust. We've got the area there, which we've uh, enlarged to fit the larger quad exhaust in carbon fiber as well. And we've uh, slimmed down the diffuser as well at the back. It was sticking out previously, so we've kind of calmed it down a little bit. And uh, Robert's just doing some detailing on it. Have you noticed some imperfections on it before we make the mold? Checking the lining out. See, Robert's a perfectionist, so you've noticed. There's a little bit of an issue over here. Probably about three mil distance from the end of the quarter panel, like the edge of the wheel arch. So we've got to rectify that before we make the mold. So we've got a Toyota Ventus here. You're probably thinking what we're doing with the Toyota Ventus, but every car is every customer's Rolls Royce, should I say. So we treat every car, what comes in the Encarn's uh, workshop as a Rolls Royce or because we know the value of a car to somebody. And this has sentimental value. Unfortunately, my friend's father passed away. This is the car that he used to drive around in many, many years ago. And uh, sadly, when he passed away, the car was sold. They searched for the car and they bought it back from the customer who finally, who, when they finally found it, they bought it back and uh, they wanted to restore it as a memory for their father. Now that is beautiful. We've done that a few times as well, but this is a special request we've had for one of my friends. And we're gonna fully restore it, bring it, back to its original form like it was back in 2009 it's a 2009 model and we're gonna do a full transformation on this and uh well not a transformation but we're gonna do a full restoration on it should i say so stay tuned for that we'll probably vlog that as well the facelift range rover conversion on here we do a lot of range rover facelift conversions uh, this is the range rover vogue which is a 2014 and we're facelifting it to a 2018 plus model and we also do that for the range rover sport as well we've also started the rolls royces as you've seen in our previous vlogs we're doing the rolls royce facelift conversions the ghost series one into a series two also we'll be doing them for the phantom and also the rolls royce race models as well so get in contact guys if you have any facelift conversions on the range rovers and definitely the rolls royces as well got the mega gigantic transformation that we've done on this Range Rover Sport behind me. It's for Mr. Shide that's come all the way from Leeds and he owns a Kashmir supermarket. And his brother had a Range Rover Sport Luma wide edition, which is nice. And he said, I want you to make my car better than his. 
or at least somewhere near. And uh, I think we've probably done that, but we'll find out soon at the end of the vlog when it comes to Clector's car and we do the reveal. So let's start from the back of the car. So we've got the rear bumper. As you can see, we did talk about the rear bumper diffuser on the one that we've showed you previously. It's a bit more subtle. This one sticks out a little bit more, but like I said to you, this is a, that one will be a different addition. So we'll have two additions to this now. Uh, we have some customers that prefer the smaller exhaust, some with the larger one, so that's what we've done. But anyway, back to the car. It's got a full respray. It was originally white, and we painted it in Nardo Grey, and uh, he requested he wanted a lighter Nardo Grey, so we tinted the color to give it that lighter effect. And it's got the full, full package, the full Cabaro wide body kit on there. It started with the top roof spoiler, mid-level roof spoiler, rear bumper, the larger quad exhaust with a carbon fiber. It's got the little fats at the bottom of the back bumper, just finishing it off. Wide arches, 60 mil wheel spacers with a 20 point shuriken. Guys, just wait for the, I'm not gonna show you the interior, just wait for the interior because we've done a full transformation in the interior as well as you can see. It's quite orange in there, Hermes is orange. And it's had all the, well, I'm not gonna say much. Let's just wait for the end. And uh, coming around the front of the car, it's had some additional things fitted onto this because we want this, to be the signature. We wanted to make a statement with this car and I think that's what I've done. But anyway, I think Shied will be arriving in a couple of hours time. So just before he arrives, let's go do a reveal on another car that I've just customized. Range Rover Sport Cabaro. Now while that car's getting customized, let's just show you this car that we've just completed and the customer is here to collect the car as well, all the way from London. Now this is Range Rover Sport 2021 model and we've, uh, Done a full barrack side conversion on it, a non-wide edition Cabaro body kit. As you can see, it consists of the front bumper, which looks very, very aggressive. And it's got the DRL running light on each side and a front lower spoiler. Now you probably think the car's lowered. Of course it is because it's got the uh, suspension, the air suspension on the car. So we've uh, put it down to the bottom, which you won't normally drive in that mode. So it would rise a little bit. But when you do park the car, I do tell the customers to park it in a lower mode. So it looks nice and aggressive. We've got the 23 inch Casanova alloy wheels on this, the gloss black and now we did uh, a Range Rover Vogue Bison barracks eye body kit which looks very similar to this and uh, that looks very aggressive as well and we put the 23 inch Casanovas on there and when the customer saw them pictures he said I want my car looking exactly like that but obviously on the Range Rover Sport model so he chose the 23 inch Casanova alloy wheels. We do have a collection of uh, barracks eye alloy wheels that do fit most SUV or premium SUVs like the BMW X5, Porsche Cayenne, Range Rover models, Land Rover, Rolls Royce etc. So uh, do check out the collection. Now we've got the low door mouldings on this car as well. We've got the top roof spoiler, beautiful roof spoiler. Now we've adjusted this a little bit. We have extended it because before it was a little bit higher up, but now we've redesigned this to fit right to the end. And it does fit the SVR models as well. So these spoilers are available separately as well. And uh, we've got the rear bumper with a carbon fiber quad exhaust, which are very popular. We do also have them in uh, chrome gold and also have them in chrome as well. And this is all blacked out, black on black, great combination. We have not done anything on the Terry on this yet, but the customer will be coming back for the car. Okay, so let's introduce you to the customer who owns the car. Sam, how's it going, my brother? Yeah. How are you doing, Evan? You all right? Very well, thank you, my brother. Okay, all the way from Watford and his friend. How you doing, my bro? Yeah, yeah, What's your name, my bro? Ahmad. Ahmad. Yeah. Ahmad, what do you think of the car? We're not going to ask Sam your shit. What do you think of the friend? The friend's opinion is always the true opinion. Yeah. Do you understand? That's why you always bring a friend with you. So, what do you think of the car? Beautiful car. So, anyway, I don't think I need to ask Sam now because his friend said yes. So he's given the authorization. But anyway, Sam, you came last night to Bradford. What do you think of Bradford? Actually, I've come a long way to here, <laughs> but to be honest, I love it. Where you, Where are you from? Watford. I'm from Watford, but I've got the business Ellsbury. In Ellsbury? Yeah, near to Watford, yeah. And what's your business? I've got Chinese takeaway. <laughs> Chinese takeaway? Yeah. Okay, let's see how this one. Where are you originally from? A Persian. Iranian. Pe Iranian, Persian. Yeah, Iranian, yes. The Persian Empire, now they've got some yeah. history behind them. But how does a Persian have a Chinese restaurant and live in London? So what? are you a Chinese chef? Yes, you know, I, I cook will, Chinese yeah, food? Yeah, I will cook as well, yeah. I actually have been to China and honestly, I do recommend 
everybody at least once in your life to visit China. That is brilliant. Right. Been to Hong Kong, been to Macau, south of China as yeah. well. Amazing. It just seems like it's a different world there. Exactly, and the food yeah. is really nice as well. Some people don't like Chinese, but some people actually love it. I actually love my Chinese food as well. What's the name of the restaurant? Lakeside Chinese. Lakeside Chinese. Yeah, Lakeside Make Chinese sure you visit away. Lakeside Chinese in in Ellsbury. In Ellsbury. And if you go there and you watch the vlog, you'll get 5% discount. So mention <laughs> the vlog, okay, guys? But anyway, forget Chinese. We're talking British luxury Man. SUV Range Rover, customized by Banagzai. Anyway, what marks do you give this car out of 10? 20. You know what I'm saying? that in Chinese or Mandarin? You know what I'm saying? That in Mandarin? You, can yeah. you speak Mandarin no, or Cantonese? No, no, no. You can't. No, sorry. But I want to make sure that I visit your restaurant when I come to London. Definitely, and I, why not? I, and I'm going to get all the Baragzai cars together now. That's an idea now. But anyway, Sam, great seeing you, my brother. Thanks very much. Enjoy the car, go I around. And uh, I'll see you in London, Definitely. my brother. All Take right. care. Cheers. Bye. Assalamu alaikum. Sultan Rai Saab, how are you doing? Shahid bhai, mashallah looking slick at the sham. How's it going mate? Good. You good? Are you ready for this car? Yeah. Listen, you asked me a question, didn't you? Is what it, was the question? Is it better than the one you put in your TikTok? Show me which one are we talking about. Let's show the audience which one. Play it. Let's have a look. They show me first. Right. Oh. Yeah, that's a tough one, that. But the question is, once we see the car, then we'll make that decision, right? Okay? Yeah. I personally think we have done a better job than that. But you got to answer that question, okay? Did you tell your dad to customize his car like that? Was it you? Are you the brains behind it? Yeah. First of all, tell us what school you go to. Hunsley Mall Primary. Hunsley Mall Primary. Right, you don't give a shout out to your friends. Shout out to uh, Oroku, shout out to Hassan, and shout out to Ibi, because they're the ones who told me, like, the Range Rover is probably the best car to get for a family. So I chose that one for my dad, and then my dad liked the choice of that. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, mate? I fight for the confidence, mate. I like that. How old are you? Uh, 11. 11 years old. Right, shy bike. I thought you're nine. <laughs> Your dad thinks you're about 15 the way you act. Okay? Are you sure? You don't be driving the car, mate, because you haven't got a license yet, okay? But anyway, yeah. the, the way is over now. It was a standard Range Rover Sport, white. What color was the interior? You, you, you don't know. Uh, you, uh, my you don't know. I let my dad I hide everything one. from him. You hid everything. Just, uh, yeah. how, what was the original color of the interior? Was it cream or black? I can't even remember. It was cream. Yeah, it was cream or black anyway, yeah. but it was a basic... Range Rover Sport. And your brother, your uncle's got a car, hasn't he? Yeah, Luma cars. Luma. Yeah. And uh, Shahid and Masood came to us and they said, we want a car that's better than my brother's car. Well, almost better than my brother's car, right? Now, so that's the key. We're in a bit of a competition now. So now the question is, we've got a lot of pressure. Pressure from Etesham, pressure from Shahid and Masood by as well, because they said we need to get the car as better than his brother's. Right, but let's go see if we've done that. Okay, so let's waste no time and let's go do the reveal. Right then, this is the time. Right, you need to keep your eyes closed so you can see through the shorts, can't you? Right, come here, Masood Bai, Shahid Bai. Right, right behind them shorts, don't look just here, okay? <laughs> right behind them shorts is your Range Rover Sport that we've customized and it's had a massive transformation. And I think it's one of my best Range Rover Sports I've ever done. 
And this is uh, like a signature body kit of mine. And also, I had to set the presidency with the Range Rover Sport Kit as the new one is coming out very soon, so stay tuned. So I thought, why not finish it off with a bang? And this car has had a mega transformation. Let's lift the shutters. Your car is behind them. You can open your eyes now, brother. Yeah. It's behind them shutters. What do you think, mate? That's wicked. Come on, mate. Whoa. What do you think? That's it. Say it. Say it. Shine. Yeah, that's really nice. Really, really nice. Do you like really, it? Really like it, yes. And the red interior. You wanted a custom Nardo grey and you wanted it slightly lighter. Have we chosen the perfect colour? Yeah. What do you think, mate? You've got a bit of grey on today, haven't you? What are your boys going to think when they see your see your car when you, your dad yeah. drops you off in school in that Range Rover? Probably going to be shocked because um, it's, it's got a nice body care and it's got red material. Question is, though, are you going to take your friends for a drive in that car with your dad? Yeah. Lucky guys, mate. Good friend he is. Good friend. Right, let's go around the car then. So basically, we've got the Ballard Zai Wide Edition Body Kit. You know what we call this body kit? Camaro. Well done, mate. You've done your research on me, haven't you? Good lad. Right. And we've got these extra things. Hey, Is that your voice ringing you? Huh? Have you already put it on TikTok? No, um, I keep getting snapped. Well, you put, listen, you can put this on Snapchat after we've done this, okay? Right. We've got the wide Cabaro body kit on there. We've got these extra things on there to make it look more aggressive. Shide, I did promise you I want to make this car look different. I had to make a statement on this car. Have I made the statement? But let's finish off and go around the car first. Wide body kit, all the arches. As you can see, it's got the bonnet, the Cabaro bonnet on there as well. That's lifted up. The 24 inch, you know what these wheels are called? Uh, sure. Shuriken wheels. 24 inch shuriken, good lad. Right. Polish face, they also come in gloss black as well. Side of the car, we've got the side steps. Got the low door mouldings. Check out the back end of this car. We've got the larger carbon fiber exhaust on there. Normally we put the smaller ones on. We've started doing the larger ones now, okay? Got the rear bumper, we've got the mid-level spoiler, top roof spoiler, battered side lettering, and the personalized number plate. You can tell us a little bit about this number plate. because uh, my uncle owns a shop and uh, it's called Kashmir. And we're from Kashmir, Pakistan. What's your favourite thing about Pakistan? The scenery and the like waterfalls. Oh, nice. I love Pakistan as well. I, I go at least once a year. I travel a lot. But Pakistan is a beautiful place to visit. Right, okay. But just to finish it off, we've missed out one thing on the back. What is it? Now, this is the final black label Baragzai badge. Hold on a minute. Calm down. Relax. <laughs> You're very keen, aren't you? Let's make sure it's central. Let me stand back one minute. Let me make sure it's right. Okay, hold on. Is that right, Shahid Roy? Yeah. What do you think? Right, go on then. Give it a seal of approval. One side and two. Well done, lad. Now you officially have been Baragzai. Welcome to the Baragzai family. Right, so we put the badge on now. Now you said, I can't wait to see the what? The stars. You get into the driver's seat. Shai, you go down that side. Let's go show you the interior. Come on. That's really oh. nice. That's really this is um 2023 interior. Yes, yes, really, really. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Are you gonna crack your neck? Calm down. <laughs> Shai, what do you think of the interior? Yeah, your son's taken over! Yeah, it's really, really nice. Really. Right, so we've got the Hermes orange interior. And normally this colour goes in the Rolls Royce, the new Rolls Royce Cullinan. They use the orange interior. Oh, yes, yes. We've done that as well, but we decided to put it in this car because the contrast between Nardo grey and orange is perfect. What does that look like? Lion. Lion's face. You know how to roar like a lion? <laughs> Look at the camera and roar like a lion. <laughs> raw. Raw. It's not raw, raw, the lion. It's <laughs> raw. Raw. <laughs> <laughs> 
Right, okay. You got the Forge Carbon Stadium. You'll check that out. Brilliant. And you got the Star Galaxy Drew Flight. What colour do you like? Uh, turquoise Yellow. green. Yellow. There you go, green. Oh. Yes. You want blue? Yeah. Meet out with the boys? <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Pink. Me, your sister's in the car. Your mum. Yeah. Red. My little sister's in red. the pink. Finishing it off, you've got the Barrack's Eye door sill lights. You open the door, they illuminate. And the puddle lights, look. When it's dark, mm. as you can see, oh yeah, look at that. When it's dark, make sure you don't step in a puddle. Okay? So Barrack's Eye puddle lights as well. So, there you have it guys. All your car is fully customised. Are you happy with it? Yeah. Maksuba, what do you think of Maksuba? He recommended Shai to come to Encar, so thank you very much for that, sir. I appreciate that. It's a coming to you. Mark out of 10. What would you give it? No, um, 14 out of 10. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. That's a large, big, big mark. Do you get more than what you usually do in school, yeah, when you come to grades? You're an A-star student, right? Make sure you study hard, okay? It's very important, because when you grow up, you can buy a car. As good as this. Yeah. Your dad's worked hard for this. Yeah. And you should appreciate everything that your dad's done. He yeah. set you the foundation. Now you need to make it better. Okay, you can do that in school. You can study hard. Yeah. Good lad. Right, Shad Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, Shad's happy with the car and uh, he'll be driving it to Leeds. This car will be one of the best Range Rover sports in Leeds. I'll guarantee you that. And uh, I'm sure if you spot it, make sure you take a picture. You can tag us, Barangs are your end cans. And if you do have a Range Rover Sport, you want to customise please do give us a call. We are the kings of 4x4 and SUV customisers, right? Yeah. Especially Range Rovers. Yeah. We've got the new Range Rover Sport coming out as well. So this is like uh, the signature body kit, the Range Rover Sport model. But thank you for watching. This has been a mega transformation. I mean, you don't really appreciate the amount of work that goes into it, but thank you to my team as well that has put the hard effort in there. And thank you for obviously Shide and his uh, family coming to get their car customized by me. But stay tuned guys and make sure you subscribe, comment and like, share all our videos and I'll see you coming here to Sham. See you when? See you in the next video. Bye.